Henry and Mutch and the Sneaky Crackers. Story by Cynthia Rowland. The Spy Kit. Henry and Henry's big dog Mutch liked to watch a TV show called The Man in the Mask. It was about a spy. Henry loved spies. One day he saw a spy kit for sale. Mutch, let's get the piggy bank. Said Henry. Henry emptied the bank and bought the kit. It was great. There was a spy hat and spy glasses. There was a spy telescope. There was a secret coat on a secret card, and best of all, there was a magne- magnificent glass. Henry looked at much through the magnifying glass. We are spies now, much. Henry said, much wagged. We will flirt with danger. Henry said, much wagged again and steal secrets. Said Henry. Much wagged harder. He was ready to be a spy. He gave the magnifying. Glass a big wet lick. Henry looked at the drooly glass. Hmm," said Henry. "Maybe you should just wear that hat." Coat. Henry put the spy glasses on his himself, and the spy hat on much, and they went outside. They walked down the. St- Street spying. Try not to look like you're spying much. Henry said. Much rolled around in a puddle. Hmm," said Henry. "Good job." Henry looked through his magnifying glass. Suddenly, he saw something suspicious. This way, much," he said. They sneaked behind a bush. They zipped between two some trash cans. Hey, look at this, Mutch," said Henry. He held his magnifying glass over a piece of paper on the ground. He read E three T two seven Q five T B. Code said Henry, but Mutch wasn't listening. He was spying. He was spying an old shoe in one of the trash cans. Mutch loved old shoes. No, Mutch said Henry. Nasty can. Mutch chewed on a big rock instead. You're doing a good job not looking like a spy. Said Henry, patting Mutch's head. Mutch wagged and spit out the rock, and said, "Spying was fun." Crackers. Henry took the code back home. It's a message, Mutch. Henry said, "And we have to crack it." Mutch wagged. He was good at cracking things. There were things all over the house that much cracked. Henry took out the secret co- card. He held it next to the message. Carefully, he began working. Since much couldn't eat the code or lick the code. Or roll over on the coat. He decided to sleep. He lay and snored, waiting to flirt with danger. Finally, Henry cracked the coat. I've got it, he said. See, Mudges opened one eye. It says, "Who are you?" Mudge opened both eyes. Well, said Henry. Another spy. For a week, Henry left secret messages by the trash cans. 
and for a week, Henry picked up secret messages by the trash cans, much to a lot of rocks. Finally, Henry left a message that said, "Meet me here, fifth, uh, fifth p.m. Monday." And a boy holding the same spy kit met him on Monday. The boy also had a dog who, also wearing a hat. Well, said Henry, let's be a club, because they were so good at cracking codes. The boys named their club Crackers. And for ID. They always carried some real crackers in their pockets. Did much ever left that? The end.